Good evening, Hyperspinners. Today we're going to be talking about how to force your games on your primary display, so get ready. Alright guys, so today we're going to be talking about how to uh, avoid the loss of focus when it comes to the light gun games. So I've got a uh, LED uh, marquee uh, and I have a hyper marquee set up. So the one thing that I was running into was light games were sometimes losing focus because when you're using a light gun you're using your left and right mouse and some of that would uh, lose focus. Um, if the game would have a bezel, then it, you know it, it was fine because the cursor would always stay within the bezel, uh, you know, based on my auto hotkey setup. But the problem was is PC games don't have a bezel, and it doesn't really support a bezel. So I had this issue, and I'm I'm sure you guys do too. If you have a secondary monitor or a, an LCD marquee. And what I found was this DMT XE. It's uh, a dual monitor uh, tools is what it stands for. And what this does is it basically forces your games or your, you know, your applications to be on your primary display. It's going to be kind of hard to uh, show you because I, I can't uh, show you my uh, my marquee uh, visual here. But you can see, like, I am stuck. Uh, on this primary display, which is good. And I'm going to go ahead and show you how to uh, get this thing set up because I, I can toggle this off and on. And uh, yeah, so let's just kind of walk through this. So uh, go ahead and download the uh, DMT off this uh, dual monitor tools uh, website. Just hit download. And you can place this anywhere. Uh, but what I tend to do is I like to everything, have everything nice and tidy. So I've got this under my tools folder uh, under Hyperspin. And what you're gonna notice is when you open this, uh, it's gonna be in your system tray. And what I prefer is upon startup, uh, this is just display. Because I want the primary display to be the only thing that you know can ever be played on. My marquee is just for looks, and if I ever need to uh, play with the settings of mar the marquee, I can just push a hotkey to basically allow that cursor to you know get to the secondary screen. So this works perfect for me, guys, and I'm sure you guys are running into the same issue if you haven't already noticed, if you have a secondary monitor. So what we're gonna do is just go down to the cursor section of this uh, app, and you're gonna say lock cursor onto screen. So all you gotta do is hit change and there's only a couple uh, keys that you can select here. And what I chose was control one. It literally can be anything guys. I, I would recommend that you use one of these uh, extra keys because at first I was just using one, thinking uh, you know I was a wise guy. One is my uh, start you know button. But, you know, if you ever, you know, add more, uh, uh, you know, tokens and you've got to press start, well, that just uh, throws that out uh, the window here. So uh, using control and then one is my uh, hotkey, you can use whatever. And once you've done that, uh, you also want to use the default cursor mode on startup. So what this is saying is when I turn off my uh, computer and when I turn it back on, What's going to happen is, is by default, it's going to lock this primary screen. So you can see my mouse is stuck in the primary display here, which is good. Uh, if I were to push Control One, I would be allowed to go back to my secondary monitor by just you know scrolling over here. Um, so that's all there is to it, guys. Uh, what you will also want to do is just make sure that this app starts. Uh, when you start up your PC and that is under general. So if you go to dual monitor tools, select general up at the top, 
just select start when Windows starts and you'll have things uh, running for you. So uh, tomorrow what I plan to do is talk through my uh, my setup for House of the Dead, the uh, PC games 1, 2, and 3, and everything works. So I will uh, catch you next time. And uh, what I'll also do is put this on uh, the Emmy Movies FTP under the tools folder. Uh, here, let's let's do that since we're all here. So I'm going to drop this under official, and we are going to go to Ninja's Dojo, Hyperspin, Zips, and Tools. So I'll drop that right in there, and uh, we'll catch you next time.